Next, we're going to be doing a figure eight splinting uh, using a uh, 36 inch SAM splint, SAM, to immobilize it. This is a, a rigid splint. Uh, for this one, we notice that the, the, um, the shoe is off. Uh, we also want to, um, you know, uh, when we, we put this piece on, um, we want to unroll the SAM splint um, all the way. And the first thing that we want to do is, um, uh, if you want to kind of find the, the foot part, uh, the center of it, um, uh, once we have that on there, basically what we're going to do is we're going to be doing a figure eight across the top of the foot. Again, is try to mold it as, as tightly as possible. Again, just remembering that you know, they do have an injury. Uh, go ahead and hold that for me. And once that's on there, I can also follow up with uh, some tape or triangular bandage. Uh, I'm going to use some uh, uh, white tape in this case. So again, you can trace the whole thing if you needed to or just t attach it where you needed to so it doesn't fall off. Again, you want to check the effectiveness of that. Um, make any adjustments that you need to to make it more snug. Uh, any gaps, you can just kind of pinch it to close the gaps. Uh, next thing we want to do is we want to check our distal pulse, uh, capillary refill and sensation um, distal to the injury. Uh, once these are mobilized, we also want to make sure um, that we refer them to uh, doctors for x-rays and further follow-up treatment. That's it.